click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, today we are going to see a single surface finishing operation which is lapping, how it is carried out and what are its specifications. So in lapping what happens? It contains small abrasive particles in the form of grit at its lower end and some loosely based oils to just keep it attached together. So they are just moved on the object to be lapped that is to be surface finished. If this is the object, tool is moved on this object and it is rotating continuously and wrapping is done. So lapping can be done to obtain high efficiency and the material of the lap which is the lap tool is made up of soft material like copper etc. So lapping is based on the principle of using abrasive material unlike in grinding it was coated on the grinding wheel in lapping it is coated on the base surface. So how much the grind is stronger and coarse the more amount of material can be easily removed by lapping process. So lapping operation is used for making optical lenses and other objects which need a good surface finish at its top end. So if I'll talk about some of the properties, the abrasive which are in lapping are small and they advance with the feed. So this is the major advantage of lapping. Also, they have the property of hardness which is to a prescribed limit so that they do not break or damage the material to be lapped. In this diagram, you can see there is a workpiece on which a lap tool is being kept. There are also some abrasions in the form of grit at the lower end of that workpiece and lapping is done on the whole workpiece by the process of spindle movement in the road reaction. So these three diagrams show lapping process on different surfaces. One is on a normal surface, second on a flat surface, how lapping is done on a flat surface. But in the third picture, lapping is done on a cylindrical surface. So in this diagram you can see there is a spindle, there is a lap tool and also abrasions are attached at proper position so that workpiece can be easily lapped. So in my first slide I have told you there are certain kind of abrasion they can be diamond or any other kind of abrasion which can be used in a lapping tool. Also soluble oils are used just to mesh the grit that is your exact abrasions with your lap and can be done easily like what your working can be done easily. And also there are certain parameters which affect your finishing process as well as your grain is the size of the grain, how bonded they are and what are the exact abrasions used. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikira and do subscribe our channel Ikira.